Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel and here are some tips and tricks. I've had a few uh, questions about screen brightness on laptops and some of you are unable to change that screen brightness and of course one of the biggest problems with screen brightness on laptops is that they are not always controlled by the Windows operating system. Sometimes they're controlled by the laptop's own software or graphics adapter software. So if you use your laptop with its um, integrated screen, because this trick does not work on external screens, on external screens you've got buttons on the screen for the brightness. Well, if your laptop, you're wondering why, or where that happens, how does it happen? So the first thing that you should look at, which is the simplest, and for a lot of people will work, is simply go on the bottom right to the quick actions. And there you will see a slider. That slider will dim or make your screen brighter, depending on your uh, computer that you use. That slider is available in the November 2019 update and the May 2019 update. If it's not there or if it's grayed out, another way that you can check it out is go into your start menu, click that settings gear icon, and go into the system tab. Here you'll see display. There's another slider right here that is the brightness of your screen slider. Once again, does this work or not? On your laptop's keyboard, there's a good chance that you've got already some indication of how to brighten or dim your screen. Now, this is an example with an Acer. My Acer has the same, actually the same, uh, my Acer Nitro 5 has the same um, kind of design. But depending on the manufacturer of your computer, the design might look a little different, but usually it kind of looks like um, a sun or, you know, it, it looks like some kind of uh, setting sun sometimes or a full sun. Um, and it's mostly used in conjunction with the FN key or function key of the laptop. So you can maybe use that. And if I use it, you'll see I have a indication on my screen that appears on the upper left, you could see that my screen brightness goes up or down when I use the function key and the brightness buttons on the keyboard. So that is the main way on most laptops to actually change their screen brightness. And it could be anywhere. On my Acer, it's on the, uh, of course, arrow keys, up, down, left, right. But on some computers, it could be at the top with the F keys once again, most of the time to use them, it's in conjunction with the FN key on your keyboard, which is usually on the bottom left of your keyboard. And by holding the FN key or function key, you can use the buttons and that will change the screen brightness. Last but not least, if nothing works, there's a last resort. And what I've shown you here, including what I'm going to show you with the last option, this is 100% of everybody that has screen brightness issues. It's in one of those options. If you still can't find it, because you, maybe you're not looking at the right place. Sometimes it's a little difficult, but in the taskbar or in your programs, you might have a uh, program for your graphics adapter. For example, I have here one for my uh, NVIDIA graphics card. Uh, there's another one because I have an Intel card, so I can also use an Intel, um, you know, set. basically it's kind of a uh, program that you download from the manufacturer of the graphics adapter that you use. And here in the settings, well, you might have in those settings a brightness setting, but you'll have to find it. It's not always easy, unfortunately. Honestly, I hate it when the manufacturer of the graphics adapter has its own settings. I rather have them in the standard way with Windows, especially for brightness and the basic features of your screen. Once again, if you're using an external screen, 
none of this will work. The external screen has its own brightness buttons. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thanks for watching.